Welcome back to Creeper World 4. So we are continuing the far side expedition. You may be like, Baron, how is that possible? You just played the level that was called Every Beginning Has an End. Well, I got to wondering because when you look at this, why is there a center view? That means I can get off center and then recenter it and I can zoom in and out, right? So it's like, well, this system seems to be just have a uh, star, all these plants, which we've beaten. But then you start to look around and you find Ever After. A journey of a billion worlds begins with flying reptiles okay so we've got to basically reclaim area and also increase the amount of life and when you look around you're like flying reptiles what are they talking about these guys hopefully we can find a way to arm them and have them help us but there's red on ore all the way over here on this little energy island there's ERNs way over there. There's Grenner over here. So there's these three main islands and then the, clearly the one that's the starting one for us. Okay, so we're definitely gonna wanna station ourselves over here and start producing a basic level. I, I think what we're gonna have to do is use porters to land over here. We also only, see this is the interesting thing. There's only two enemies on this, right? But there's, this thing is actually orange. It's not blue in color. So I think orange ones just produce seeds, but seeds and blob nests is a little worrisome. There's these totems around here, which should attract most of them. But I think we're gonna need to find ways of landing resources over here and then shipping them back. So we're gonna have to use porters and if possible, a rift. But in order to build rifts, you need red on. So this island here seems to be to our strategy here. So let's see, once we get these up and running, we'll have a ton of energy. And then I think we're gonna need at least, what, two mortars around here? The mines are up and they call them mines. And then we will want some snipers to help defend ourselves against the enemy threat, as well as I think continue producing mines is gonna be key there's just so much to do and then getting early porters might be helpful so we've got yeah see okay ever after you're they're counting the eggs so I call them seeds but eggs they must be popping from the spore launcher we've got a lot to worry about it, it looks not threatening with two enemies but this there's clearly something ominous here and we're gonna have to play this level in a way which maybe we have not played before all right we've got this guy let's land some energy over here and I think what we're gonna want is a few cannons to send over there. All the while, building mines. Yeah, so these big jugs there, they were just energy reserves. So I need to capture this as soon as we get our first two gun platforms. Building a lot of things at the same time. And we'll have them stock up on energy for a little bit. One minute and 56 seconds. Uh, maybe, I think we should land after the blob nest attacks. I don't know for certain. And then probably we'll want to land snipers there too, because if blobs and seeds are the biggest threat, that's what we're going to need to fight them off is the snipers. Minute 23. All right, then I'm just going to go ham on miners until that first attack. And then we're going to go out and try to capture. And I'll have a second porter over here. And I think I'd like a third mortar here to defend our home island. I have a ton of snipers. Oh, we need a factory. Okay. He's going to fire in a minute that burp, burp, burp is uh, an alarm. It's a bio alarm saying, hey, creeper boy, the blobby blobsters are coming. We are just producing insane amounts of stuff. Lots of mines. Okay, 20 seconds. Then we move out and attack. I, I wanna draw the blobs over here to us. All right, where do they go? How many blobs and where do they go? Okay, they're heading over here. No eggs. What? These, this thing has to be producing eggs. Okay, we've done it. All right, I need to land two guns on opposite sides easy we had so many snipers we were definitely prepared to land that and then i need to produce a porter in the middle to drop off arg we'll drop it right near the factory and i'm thinking wait a minute whoa 14 eggs oh there's seven here seven just went in the blob nest i think this next blob is gonna take it oh my gosh they're actually coming relatively soon okay we need at least two snipers over there because otherwise we'll just get overwhelmed okay maybe a third one just to be certain. And by that, we'll get a fourth one too. Okay, so this guy is dropping off the red on ore, right? Is he in route? Do we see him? He's still being produced, I think. Where is he? Oh wait, did I? Oh, he needs to be dropping red on ore, not arg. I'm, I made him send the wrong stuff. There we go. That should be working. I think I need to start terraforming over there. Oh, more blobs, but they didn't attack our little outpost island. And this one's next, the Grenar one. And then we'll go after upgrade island. Oh, something just blew up. We're doing well on energy production because I've just been spamming mining deposits here. Stuff still blows up. Get these guys inside the perimeter and maybe turrets on the outside. And then when we can, when we have enough, we'll produce, there we go. Okay, then what I need to do is get a M riff. I'll do that with the first one. We need to build them one at a time. I can't overextend myself. Okay, this looks pretty well fortified. Now on this side, oh, I can definitely put, we're gonna have to, we're gonna need a ton of energy, which I guess we have right now. 
A little bit of a little fortified outcropping. And I want one of my new snipers to start popping seeds. Oh, blobby boys are attacking. Oh gosh, look at this. Okay, we're snapping these. Look at this. This is going to get a little bit crazy once we start busting these seeds. Uh, or eggs. I just you, you just can't have too many of them out there. Okay, this island is going to be major key for destroying them. That should alleviate a lot of the tension, which will allow us to get over here. I'm going to build another portal, a porter, a third one. And I'll have you drop energy right here to build a tower. Okay, what's happening over here? Are we doing okay? Yeah. I wonder if I could even terraform some a wall here. A terp would be good. Let's get a terp out. We're gonna try to take the Grenar node. And you know what? I'm actually gonna terraform like here. We're gonna turn this to a 10. We'll build a little land bridge. <laughs> okay, one island secured. Seeds are at least at 40. If they get too far out, we do snipe them. Gotta find little spots to put them. Yeah, I'm gonna need to terraform this too. Look at that. Look at these little waves. Okay, got the strategy down. We'll take this island. All right, now I need a porter delivering... We need him delivering Arg over here so I can build an M-Rift. Jeez, that's so many seeds out there. And they're just out of range, I guess? Oh, wow, that's a lot of spillage over there. Will he be able to defend that? What's producing that? Blue sponge? And the pterodons are finding little landing zones. That's nice. That's a lot of sniping happening. Okay, when we get that rift done, I'll be able to get rid of the porter and have more room. I could even put some mortars here, which will allow me to put more snipers on the front lines. Okay, we have it. Good. Now I can delete this thing and get room. Oh, well, he was in the middle of the sky and he just got dropped. Okay, and now I can actually cancel the routes of the energy and I can land them over here and start taking that. Although those shields are pretty much almost down, right? And what I need to do is start building another M-Rift here. I need to claim that island before it's gone. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Sneaking in. 63 eggs, man. Yeah, so it's very, like, involved island hopping here. Okay, we've taken this. We're destroying the blobs well before they get over here. All right, we're getting the upgrades from that island. Good, good. Let's do move speed and build speed. And we'll get fire rate and fire range a little bit later. I need to have the energy to sustain us here. Yeah, okay, that's that's doing much, much better. There's still like 67 something eggs out there. Get the M rift over here. Okay, the M rift is done. We don't need to be sending energy over there. We can send it, I guess over here for now till that energy gate's done. I wanna build a shield, like right on the edge there. Let's see what that does. And then I think it's clear what we need is a refinery over here. And do we have one of these built yet? No, it's still being built. We're almost going to be able to delete all of the porters and hope we don't need them later. How's our terraforming going? Honestly, not the best. Wonder why they're not be able to get that. Wonder if it needs to be cleared of creeper for them to do it. Maybe that's the case. Oh, what's sniping? What's happening? What's up? Okay, that portal's done. Yes. Let's do fire rate. I need to get these liftic, these totems powered. All right, so I'm basically terraforming, trying to increase the size of my island so that I can put more guns on them. Got some shields going here, so maybe we terraform this area too. That's what we have to do. Shield and then terraform behind it. Oh my gosh. It seems like they're getting flooded. The massive terraforming experiment is happening. Uh, I wonder if I could build a bridge over to these ERNs maybe from here? There's 110 eggs out there though. That's pretty terrifying. Jeez. 111 eggs. You know, maybe it's time we build a rocket. Okay, we need some... Clearly, we need some super weapons here. I've, I feel like I've never terraformed so much in a level than I am doing right now. Oh, something just fired off. I think it was the uh, ICBM, our rocket pad. I call it an intercontinental ballistic missile, but in technicality, it's a, a rocket firing a satellite that's going to give us weapons. Now, I don't know what damper does. H. Well, that wasn't helpful. Oh god, I accidentally fired it there. That's not what I meant to do. I don't know what that does, but uh, that's how I use my satellite. Dang it. All right, we're building a great wall. What does damper do? That's super strange. I think it was a waste, but definitely trying something new. He's going up again. Oh my god, look at that. That's terrifying. Stop the waves. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. What's happening over here? I think we should be able to defend it, but maybe just barely. There's got to be a way to tell the height. Oh, there is. Okay, in the bottom left. So this is actually a height of 12. So what I should be doing is terraforming this to 12. Got it. Today I learned. Okay, and we just cover the whole area in 12. Which isn't confusing at all since 15 is kind of similar. This is actually 12 as well. Shoot. 
Ooh, and now we can call in the rain. All right, I want to see if the rain satellite attack. Let's see. Actually, where do I want to target to see if I can't get there? Maybe this one's actually kind of the closest. All right, make it rain, baby. Orbital dropped artillery shells from our satellite. I don't think they take out the seeds, though. Eggs. Dang, that's so cool. <laughs> Ooh, it's getting here. Look at this. Four turrets pushing back a wave. It's like a little mini Thermopylae. I guess one of the things we could do is call in the rain over here. Oh, and look at that. Trees are growing after we clear out the Cleeper, so we are bringing life. Whoa, look at this. The terraforming is done. Oh, these snipers are going to start destroying so many seeds. We might actually have problems over here. And now we'll expand here under satellite bombardment. This is the progress we've made. We're, we're pushing out and taking this. This is actually reclaiming about almost a quarter of what they want us to be able to reclaim. And I'm just trying to build like this beastly front line over here. And then I'll try to build an earthen wall and maybe level this all out. And I don't know, maybe start working on an airfield or something. We're still terraforming this island. So terraforming, I, I bit off more than I could chew on those islands. And I think it seriously delayed our plans. So this is Delta, f or this is a terraform level of five. Who would have thought this level, which seemed so easy, would be so difficult? I'm just doing a mass terraforming over here. Trying to build maybe some airfields or something. Maybe more missiles. Although I guess one of the issues is the seed level seems to keep just rising. Ooh, I can put a runway in. I feel like once you get a very strong air force, that's when things really start to take a turn. We could also even produce even more satellites as well, but it's just like a matter of, do we have the energy for it? Let's get these upgrades. I want to upgrade one of my snipers to start just destroying all of these eggs. Okay, our airfield is done. Time to get the bombers. All right. Ooh, yeah. So if this guy, this guy gets an ERN, what happens? Okay, he just got it. Oh my gosh, his range is insane. Oh no, this is gonna create like titanic amounts of waves. All right, we need to chill you out for a little bit. Chill out, chill out. We need to manage this for a while. I mean, look at that. <laughs> There's gonna be absolute tidal waves. Okay, I have an idea. What we're gonna do is put him back in a position and then call in rain around the seeds he's gonna be firing, right? So satellite bombardment to help suppress this. There we go. That's working better. And I think I want another one that's gonna be upgraded. Yikes. Ooh, we're getting close to being out of energy. Look at that, down to 86 seeds. Look at this guy just twirling around, 360 no scoping it. All right, so I think you need to get over here now. I do wish I had more rain, more satellite rain. Let's make two more then, two more rockets. Down to 35 eggs. Seeds, eggs, you you get it. Oh, this guy probably gonna have to be pulled back just to protect him. Orbital oh, bombardment is completed. I feel like we're like the Galactic Empire with some of the toys that we have available to us. Look at these, man, the rockets. How do we get more Grenar? I don't think we're gonna be able to, honestly. So maybe it's a little premature to be building all these rockets. All right. We're starting to take the middle ground after about an hour of work is starting to pay off. And I even got a little supply line here. We might actually even be able to com complete a route from our main base. Look at that. Look how much that's going to be. Oh, that's going to be kind of... <laughs> I wonder if I could just... You know what? Let's make a little blitz run here. If I can silence these two things, it's going to be so much easier to just start doing all of this, right? All right. It's time to get rid of this annoying thing. Ooh, we have two rockets firing. There we go. One is nullified. That way, whenever this guy spawns in, man, he, he's dead. He's pretty much dead. I wonder though, when we get this done, if it's gonna spawn, if it's gonna allow us to get uh, another secret level. There we go. We've nullified all enemies. Now, what I wanted to do was create a linkage from our main base. There we go. <laughs> now we'll get a, an advanced power line. And there's only seven eggs left. They're all over here. All right, move super sniper boy into position and out of position. Now all we have to do is get over here. I can make it rain. I'm gonna make it rain. We may have reclaimed life, but we sure turned this into like a massive industrial military complex. Like, look at this. This is the planet. Trees are regrowing. <laughs> uh, it's nuts. All right, there we go. We should be able to get that last totem. Oh, okay, objective obtained. Now we just gotta reclaim and, and regrow the life. We're almost there. Let's get the Air Force involved. Uh, they haven't really been involved in a while because we forgot which target we were shooting at. 
Yay! I think we did it. Now we just gotta regrow the life. And it seems to only regrow where I have my towers. So let's put them everywhere. It'd be cool if there was like a predetermined grid you could use. So my towers aren't just like, oh man, if you have OCD, you'd be like, mm-mm, nope. I'm not going to that planet ever. I mean, have we covered the entire planet? It, well, I'm just spamming towers. <laughs> oh God. I think that's like the whole planet, man. Life is coming to this planet via spider webs of logistics. So let's go ahead and speed this up 4x. Looking for these like random little spots. Oh my gosh, they they actually really want me to cover the entire planet, don't they? Where have I not done it? Oh, over here. This is kind of insane. Nine, I'm at 98.2 and we're at 4x speed. Uh-oh. There's like these little holdouts. Look at my frames. I'm at 99.5 and my, my frames are really not doing too good right now. 97.7. Y'all gonna do this to me, aren't you? This is the wackiest level I've ever played. Oh, here we go. There was a lot back by my main base, actually. 97.8. All right, this is why being careful in OCD is good. Cause it's moments like these that I actually went from 98 to 97.9. I don't know how. This is unbelievable. How does one reclaim life? <laughs> I don't know. I'm at 98 and I can't get above it. You know what? I wonder if the anti-creeper needs to be turned off. How do you get rid of anti-creeper? Don't tell me I screwed myself over with anti-creeper. I wish you could just mass terraform. I don't know. 98.3 seems good. And that covers probably more than 2%. Plus there's trees growing underneath it. What if we just destroy these? Just destroyed all those things. Oh, that is how we do it. Okay. We clear off the surface area of these cannons and we up our percentages. Yes. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Now I need to reclaim 100%. How do you reclaim more than 100%? Is this level borked? I think it says 100, but like maybe there's gotta be something, right? Does anybody know? I'm an hour 42 in, man. I, I, I need to be able to beat this thing. What a creepy level, man. Conversion? I don't even know what conversion does. I'm just covering the earth with anti-creeper. Oh, okay, finally. I don't know what we did, but we finally got the reclaim charge. It must have been one little blop of creeper somewhere hiding out, but thank goodness we, we finished it. Oh my gosh, rift jump. An hour and 45 minutes. That was like as much as we spent on the final level. Everyone else seemed to do it in a much better time. Oh no, we did it wrong. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching another episode of Creeper World 4. Let's see. I want to see if there's like another level out there. We've finished that one. Is there anything else? I don't think so, actually. Maybe not. Yeah, I think that might be it, at least for right now. So we found the secret level. We beat it. It took forever. If you guys want to see more, let me know. Pull the trigger on the like button. Share the video with a friend. Subscribe if you're new. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.